What is up everybody, Rai here, and welcome back to Beyond Two Souls. We just sealed away Mr. Yitate Potato Tots, and we are now going to a sacred burial ground or something. I think that's what he said. <laughs> stop, stop stopping at mid-place. Mid ah, uh, shit. Yeah, she is Shima Shami's uh, robe or cloth. Shit, I have to move. <laughs> Let's not leave him waiting. I have to tell you, if I was grading this game right now, I'd give an A for graphics. This is beyond beautiful. Both died. These are the bones of your ancestors. I'm sure they would have wanted to be buried alongside their own people. Shimasani and his ancestors. He's happy where he is. Was there another way? Wait, wait, wait. I just I just thought of something. Maybe I could have used Aiden to go into the house and heal his wound. Remember when we healed uh What's his name? What's his name? It was the really tall, deprived dude, homeless dude. I can't remember his name for the life of me. Jimmy. Jimmy. Like, we healed his wounds by allocating the two points together. Could I have done that and got him to come out as the fifth soul? I don't know if we, if we would have had time. I don't know. Oh man. This is where the guy was, right? Up here?
It's like Aiden. He's attached. So your decision is made? You're leaving? There's just things that I have to work out. Things from my past. I think I'm ready to face them now. You did a lot for us, Jody. For us and for our people. If you don't find what you're looking for, just come back here. You'll always find a home here. to get it going again. Take it. It's yours. It's the least we can do to thank you. I don't know if I if I would have kissed him. Maybe that would change the ending, or I don't know. My mindset was that it was kind of early in to do that. <laughs> would have been really abrupt. Ready? Yeah. Right after the Hold. condenser. Okay, I'm recording. I concentrate, Jody. Tell me if you feel anything in particular about any of these objects. Okay. Nathan, someone named Ryan Clayton is here to see you. He says you know what it's about. Yes. I'll be back in a moment. Clayton, he's the guy who brings us into the CIA. I like Jody with long hair.
Listen. I never get around to telling her I need more time. No. Professor Dawkins, she needs to come with me today. I, I have my orders. Christ, she's only a child. My assistant and I are the only family she's got. She doesn't have any idea what's out there. Look, Dawkins, I see your side of it. All right, I do. But orders are orders, right? You gonna bring her to me or do I have to go and get her? Jody, could you come here, please? All right. Let's see what Ryan Seacrest wants. What's what's going on, Nathan? You, you look upset. Jody, this is Ryan Clayton from the CIA. The agents. The agency wants you to join their military school program at Camp Perry. Ryan's going to take care of you from now on. You have to go with him, Jody. Today. I don't understand. Why me? This unit belongs to the CIA. They've been tracking your case ever since you arrived. They know what you and Aiden can do. Angry. I am not a child. I can make my own decisions. No one can force me to go. Hey, Jody, I know. It's difficult, but you need to understand this is a great opportunity for you. No one can tell me what to do with my life. Jesus, listen up, Miss Holmes. I don't give a shit about your pathetic adolescent pouting, all right? You can rant and rave all you want, but you'll shut your mouth and do as you're told. I'll go get my things. <laughs> Only the essentials. We've got everything you need at Camp Perry. I didn't even make a decision. <laughs> I was going to say insult, but I pressed too late. You guys are happy because I am ruining your place. It's okay, Jody. Alright. Let's get your stuff. connection you have with your family. If they have a problem with it, I will kick their asses. <laughs> I 
Anything in here? No? <laughs> essentials my ass. These are my essentials. These are the connections I have with the people I care about. And if they have an issue with it, they can kiss my- kiss the whitest part of my butt. Oh, oh, family. I won't make her give up. I think that option was to tear the picture, maybe, but I'm not going to do that. I don't feel resentment towards her family, but... You know, I'm disappointed. At least in the dad. Ryan Seacrest has a problem with it. And oh well. the good and bad times. I'll come and see you as soon as I can. I'll never let you down. You know that, don't you? I'll always be there for you. Time to go. Welcome to the CIA indeed. The embassy, the dinner. This is sometime after the embassy, okay. So if this is well after I get into the whole regimen. if you got my email what we what what email the one I sent three days ago you know I've I've actually been having problems with my computer what what was the email about dinner tonight fancy restaurant uh, anyway it, it's too late now so maybe another time shit shit I'm so sorry I, I... You know, why, why don't you just come over here for dinner tonight? I mean, you wanted to see my apartment anyway, so... Um, sure, but I... How about around eight? Just... Okay. Yeah, I'll, I'll bring a kick-ass bottle of wine. See you later. I don't know if I like this. to my computer. You didn't want me to see Ryan. It's not your call, Aiden. I can do what I want. Fuck this. Fuck this! We're not gonna start this again! I'm not yours, Aiden! I can have a relationship with whoever I want. Oh, shit. This is my life. Oh, do you fucking hear me? This is my life. You know what? I, 
happen to think Ryan is great. He's charming, he's intelligent, he's funny. And I think I'm falling for him. Ew! Okay. Okay. It's seven o'clock. I have an hour to make dinner, tidy up, and make myself look good. Ew! I should have I should have kissed the guy who we met in you know, in that thing with the Navajos and all that. Ew! I don't want to go out with Ryan Seacrest. I don't know why I keep calling him that, by the way. I'm probably totally misinterpreting what the two of them look like. So, mm. yeah, apparently we have a date with Destiny or the guy who badmouthed us on the very first day. Granted. Granted, he isn't that bad looking, but still, I have my suspicions about him, so... Next video, we will see how this whole dinner date goes down, and who knows, maybe I'll change my tune. You know, it depends entirely on how he treats me. Oh god, what am I saying? Uh, hope you guys liked the video. If you did, be sh I encourage you to leave a like as it helps and benefits the growth of the channel, and it tells me you guys are enjoying this playthrough. I'm Rai. Happy dating, everybody. God. Okay, no sex on the first date. That's all I'm going to be thinking of. No sex on the first date. If he tries to, he can talk to the hand, sister. And no, I don't care if you don't... If you want it. I don't want it. Wait, six, seven... He's late. Is he fashionably late? 